without touching the screen, there will be um, programmatic obs observation of impressions and clicks that are getting fired from the device and no ad was shown and no one was touching the screen. And this is happening at scale. When we see the click, we actually detect who it's clicking through. And so it could click through to an affiliate network, which then clicks through to a different affiliate network, which then clicks through to an ad network, which then clicks through to a mobile measurement partner. And by doing that, we now have tracked the site IDs from the originating app all the way through the ecosystem to the actual MMP. Why is that interesting? We saw a set of apps that were broadcasting that they were the Lenovo uh, app, when in fact it had nothing to do with Lenovo. It was a completely fake click mm -hmm. on a selfie uh, app. But it was um, broadcasting to the MMP that it was Lenovo. So if the advertisers only view into the ecosystem is what the mobile measurement provider gives them, they would think they got a click from the Lenovo app. Wow, that's high quality. All right. That's useful. When in reality, it was from a selfie app through three different layers of affiliate networks. So each one can re... They're all rebrokering. You could think of it as almost like click laundering. Okay, so it's like a chain of washing. You're this. washing the clicks. That's exactly right. right. Right, right. So this is this is fundamentally how fraud is done at scale. Thank you for watching to the end. You are awesome. Don't forget to share, like, and subscribe if you want to get inside of the game industry. And if you are in the game industry already, this is the right place for you. We are running a global networking community of everybody in the game industry, and this is a perfect platform for you to get all the resources you need to publish your games or get your games promoted. Take care, guys, and see you in the next show.